All right, so uh, what's good? Listen, I actually honestly it should be mo mostly like uh, I'll say me and find anything, but probably not around, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, obviously they roll with you guys, right? I think we should like fully fucking do what you had. I think you suggested this in the past too. That's fucking. So now that you could clean a lot of fucking money and there's a lot more money to be made, I feel like we should just like fucking hold down the uh, money spot. And anyone that. Uh, even wants to fucking do, you know, money runs, we gotta make sure we know who it is. Mm, okay. I mean, everybody, bro. Fuck these pussies, bro. What about the manor? Same thing. Robbing same, them, same, bitch. Same, same thing. Every single hey, time. Hey, what about, what about people you guys <laughs> work with, like, uh, kind of syrup? Then they better make a deal with someone. I'm down. You guys, are we gonna like back each other though? Like, fuck yeah! All right. I mean, let's be honest, bro. You guys don't need backing. We don't need backing. I, I think for the most part, as long as like you know, they they know that we're both holding it down. So how do you guys? So how do you, like when you say hold it down? Like what do, what do you mean? We just rob everybody and we just make deals with everybody. I mean, I've been talking to Fanny nonstop about like having the same numbers of that we're gonna be have people push to us anyways. Yeah, Ming and Fanny told me the numbers y'all talked about. It's twenty twenty, no. Oh, no, we dropped it to 15 because um, you could actually clean a shit ton of money. It's, like, really easy to do runs. Yeah, how this guy fucking Miggy on my phone talking about, uh, pressing me about some percentages, dog. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm angry. <laughs> I mean, realistically, the way I see it is uh, this entire, these 12 hours of the storm, we just control. I'm not going to, listen, truth is, CG is going to do what they do next storm, and... I'm not even close around enough to really. I'm a, yeah, we ain't even around. The, yeah, like so. I think we just control these twelve hours, and not only these twelve hours, but we've even been talking about like what happens. I don't know if you guys know this, but like pretty much, honestly, after fucking K goes to sleep, everyone goes crazy and starts doing money runs at that time. The last like three hours of the storm, people just go crazy. So some of our boys are gonna be waking up at that time too and start robbing those people. You know, like the like the three four hours before AU. So. Bro. That place is lively, bro. Okay, so let me ask you a question, right? Because me and me and Miggy spoke about this a while back, like maybe a month ago. Do you guys yeah. just plan this to make everyone do a deal, or do you guys want to tax this spot? Ooh. We could do both. I mean, if people want to do the runs, then we just make them pay something. Um, it all comes down to us making money, right? So like, I disagree with that, because then it makes it more complicated than what it needs to be. Right? I mean, you think you think we should just have people just? Oh, well, thing is, through us. Realistically, okay, if everyone guys... goes through us. Realistically, we're not going to be able to do all money runs ourselves. Only it's just going to be way too much money. I disagree. Do you guys even do them though? Like I yeah. swear, I only see like we one do or two lot. guys doing them. Oh, we do them shits all yeah, day. Some of us, yeah. They sound like okay. convoys. We just roll out solo, kind of. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I mean, think it's a good thing because look, if people find out that it's us two. You know, doing yeah. this shit together, they're not gonna want no fucking smoke. And they're just gonna Well yeah, I mean I think if I think if I think if we could choose one, the best thing that we should do is is make everybody go through us. That way it clears like a lot of the headaches. And then if, if people are like um uh you know, if people are like super super against it, then we just don't let them ever run their money. I don't know man, like it's the same thing with back in the day, right? Like, with the meth guy. Like, you know, it's flippy. I wanted to control the meth guy so badly. And not let people do runs. And if they wanted to do runs, tax them. So, uh, you know, I think things like this should be, like, controlled by gangs. You know, like, sure, we can say, like, oh, you got to go through us. You got to do this. But, you know, even just having conversations with people it might change our outlooks on how things will be, you know? So. Yeah, I'm just I'm just looking at in the sense of like the way it makes the most sense, right? Because you guys want to take the route of like uh, people come for us to take deals. I mean, a lot of these people already have deals, if you know, and you guys are, I assume already have deals with a lot of these people that already run money. I think really would change. I mean, truthfully, the only thing that we're really fucking doing for the most part 
is okay there is a few people that we don't do deals with and i mean also okay for example civ gang do you guys do deals with them no, i uh, rob them i honestly they, don't they, know everyone that making fun of those deals with so there's a lot of people like i don't know you'd have to ask them you know what i mean yeah i mean listen they told me that they're okay they're asking me to fucking do it for like 12 percent or some shit so i know um granny isn't close with them so i don't think she'd be giving them a, a special deal so they're they're going through someone else i don't know who else buys money besides you as an us i don't know i don't know who buys who money but i know who does. runs it i know i know saints run money i know yeah i know uh the manor run money there's three people that there's three groups that run convoys saints manor and then uh lane booty's crew vagos vagos youtube i don't know i don't know i don't know what the vagos and sly run are you still holding Vago's pocket, or would you rob them? I mean, if they, I mean, I'm not holding the pocket, but I'm cool with them. You know, but uh, yeah, man, if this deal goes, it's the way I see it, bro. I don't know if you if you're down for this. I feel like there's some people that you kind of rather not press, and there's some people that we kind of rather not press. You know, we could just you know, other people press them or whatever. Because the thing is, right, Vago's. I mean, if it comes down to it, we could we could press them. You rather not be with them. Truthfully, KC, I rather not be with them. I'm a you honest with you. I only have only have one crew I wouldn't be with. And that's the that's the guild. Everyone else I don't really give a fuck about. Okay, then I mean is what it is. I think we could honestly I think if we did this, most people are just gonna make deals with us. One hundred percent. Listen, the main thing that, that that's dog shit about all this is the fact that people are going to sleep. And then other people are coming out and then, uh, you know, doing money runs and then they're buying at 10% as well, which fucks over all of our business. Yeah. Because they're safe to do money runs because no one's robbing them. So if you're fucking, if you're literally uh, out there doing um, money runs, but you're buying at 10% with no risk, then it's fucked. And if they do, if they hatch like the last like four, three hours of storm and they're doing it like deep, they can clean a lot of fucking money. So, so be honest, you guys go out there and rob these money runners often because no. we do that shit every day. No, no. We don't. Only we, times we go out we, every fucking day. Only times we've done it when we like went to go rob people, we told them sell to us. So if not, you're getting robbed. We give like the pre warning and then never see them again or forget the next day. All right. But I think that we got to make it like a lot less of that. You know what I mean? And just rob people. And then tell them to come through. Yeah. So if this does go through, you guys realize you guys are gonna have to start rolling out to him. Oh yeah, of course. Right. Of course. I mean, like, that's what I'm saying. Like a lot of our boys are dying to wake up before storm and uh, and uh, and uh, you know rob them. I mean, listen, I'm I'm open to the idea. Uh, obviously, gonna speak to the rest of the boys, see what they think. But uh, yeah, we'll find out. I mean, we can have another conversation with Ming and Fanny come around as well because they know like your guys as people, you know. Yeah, and yeah, like, they're, they're the ones that are the ones that do the money run stuff. So that obviously they don't. Yeah, 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 yeah. Also, yeah. oh, who's this in front of me? Who's this? Talking about me? Yeah. Oh, it's RJ. By the way, word of advice, bro, don't wear that mask. Why? Um. Looks, looks bad. If you're ever doing illegal stuff and the cops see you from a distance, bro, yeah, you don't have a mask on. Really? Okay. Yeah. I hear that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So be careful. Uh, that bit me in the ass, that mask. Oh, that's crazy. He's, He's making you take your mask off, bro. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Nah, nah, but yeah, just be careful because cops don't, from a distance, if they're like, if they're watching you with a camera or some shit, they won't, uh, yeah, they won't see that mask. Okay, fine. All right. Well, yeah, I mean, shit. Like I said, I'm open to it, but I will go speak to the boys and uh, hit you guys up. Okay. You, got, you guys are you guys are like all like on board with this, right? Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. All right, let me go uh, speak to the rest of my crew. I'll let you guys know, all right? All right, sounds all right. good. I will see you. All right, see you guys around. See ya. Peace. Mm. I don't really know how I feel about it, to be honest. 